right back with you. It is Sunday, September 12th, going over some stocks. Let's look at EEIQ. Just mentioned this in uh, Stockwitz. So this had a very big run here. Elite Education Group International LTD. Weird formation right here on March 25th. And then it spiked to 26. This went all the way up to 35.20. Look at this. All the way up. Came down very hard after that. If you, a big spike here. And then this sort of fell into this like very tight channel since April, May, you know, the six level, went down to the three level. And you can see this, look at this channel, extremely tight and really a wedge, just a channel, very tight channel. Found the bottom of three though, look at three. These wicks came up, down 375. 425, look at this. Big volume on Friday. This was 36 million with a big wick up. And let's take a look. Yes, shot down at the open, pulled out a lot of longs, and it bounced over five. And look at that, break to 750. And then we finally went back to six. Now, on the weekly on this, you have a big, look at this big pull up. Another one, and it faded. Now, you have stochastics going up right here. 3626, you have white over red, very bullish. Your formation, because this is a newer stock here, 20 EMA, 30 EMA, it's trying to you know, get on the chart here, which is a good sign this is coming up. So 23 fibs is at about 1060. So, you know, that would probably be the target area is the monthly. So I'm looking at that fibs level right here, just above 10. We'll see if we can get that. This is a big move down from 35 plus. Now you're overbought here, sort of turning down at that big wick. Is that a selling wick? You know, possibly it could pull back. Um, I like the weekly though. The weekly's tell me there's more room to run of this. They could really push this. So yeah, if this does fall back, I wouldn't like it to see, even if it puts in a huge candle, like for I like for the stop here, the EMAs. So I'd like that to hold right here. And then, you know, my target is going to be 10. We'll see, you know, 7, 8, 10. We'll see if we can get there each step by step. Or if it's a big candle, one big move. So, you yeah, know, this is a tremendous, um, very tight channel and it broke out. Let's see the news on this. Finviz has anything. All right, so 1.6 million float. That's what they have, extremely low float. 81% insider zone. They want this stock to go up. 46 million market cap. <clears throat> Elite educational group provides study abroad, post-study services, Chinese students in the United States. Companies founded in 2012, Middletown, Ohio. Uh, let's see if they have any news on this. Uh, I'm looking at Yahoo Finance. Let's see here. Uh, he surge right here. Let's see if they have anything. 41 stocks moving higher today. This has been Zynga. But is there any news? I don't see anything here. Is anything showing here? I do not see anything. Now, three months ago, I don't see nothing. I don't see no news. So if anyone has news on this, I mean, I'm looking usually, you know, by a few days later, they should have some here in um, fin, fin this. So there, I don't see no news. This is really crazy. Could be just a uh, low float mover here. You know, this bottom technically, technically moving now because it was so hammered. That's possible. If anyone has news on this, put it in my, um, my YouTube after I do this video. So we'll see what the news on this is, if there's anything. But you know, technically, this has room to run. Traders are seeing it now. They can jump in that weekly right here. Look at that. You're turning up. That is a very big sign. Uh, right here. See, so I have that wick there right over eight. So that's going to be, well, it's close, but that's his first stop. Now we went to six, pull back pretty hard. So watch them levels. See if we can get seven to 10 now. See what this does here. If it pulls back, bounces a little bit with lower volume, and then we come up again. So. You know, EEIQ, interesting stock in the educational space. 
study uh, services Chinese students in the United States with very low flow. Uh, 46 million market cap, interesting. All right, so that's it. Please subscribe to Mike Kim and Trade Alerts on YouTube. Smash the like button, leave comments. Twitter, Mike J Trades. Instagram, Mike Kim and Alerts. Stock Quits, Mike Kim and Alerts. TikTok, Mike Kim and Trades. All right, that's it. Peace.